What's up? My name's Amanda. I love eating. And welcome to my channel where I do whatever I want. So the people that have seen this video already, I had to repost it because of a few things. Um, <laughs> I totally showed my titties. Ahem. So yeah, if you saw this video already, I'm sorry. Please watch it again though, it's funny. Please, I need the ad set. So if you saw this video already, I'm sorry, but watch it again though. Yeah. Hi. I'm a tourist, so I have like this thing with eating that is like, ooh! I went to my local Snappers. If you don't know what Snappers is, check it out bitch i'm eating the dessert before the food i'm actually gonna do like a mix but so it really don't make no sense but mm. oh, wait a second i forgot what neighborhood i'm in i'm parked at a park right now parked at a park yeah, interesting one time when i was like 13 i came with some friends to mary j and uh sorry monetization reason one time i came with my friends to do that we realized that we didn't bring a lighter we went around all the houses that are by this park and we knocked on the door asking for a lighter 14 years old we ain't found a lighter. You want to get into the video? I think you want to get into the video. So this video consists of a mukbang, apparently. Damn, they ain't give me no napkins. I also got butt ass naked and took a picture. And I painted it just as a little exercise to learn how to love myself more. And I'm also going to be doing some self-care and other stuff. I don't know. Let me eat. Go watch the video. I got to go on with some self-care. For example, I'm going to put on this face mask. Oh, my God. <laughs> this actually isn't Wizards of the Waving Place, so I didn't just magically put that on my face. So... Yeah. This is actually how I actually put it on. I didn't just slap it on, but that would have been fun. Oh. Oh. Uh, I actually just ate that. And I don't know why I was thinking that because it says honey, I can treat it like honey. This is just a honey face mask that I like to do after a shower. I also have these little eye thingies. Oh, fuck. I just dropped it. Uh, I actually dropped one on the floor, so. But so we're just gonna do one eye for right now. Oh my god, all this honey fell on me, dude. That's disgusting. I'm not a little kid, I swear to god, I know how to do things. Sometimes things just go the wrong way. I also like to put on some deodorant after I get out the shower. That's kind of evident. <laughs> like, that's something that you should be doing. The deodorant that I use is from Native. Native deodorant. Paraben free, aluminum free. Wow, I have the voice for that. Yeah, the one I've been using recently is the lavender and rose flavor. Flavor? Are you like eating it or something? I mean, you ate your face mask, so I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, I've been using the lavender and rose one and it smells bomb. Oh, okay, wow. This is the one I've been using, this one that I take everywhere if I go somewhere, the one that I put on all the time. And I'm actually partying with them for this video. Okay. Listen, I do not partner with companies unless I stand by them. This is native and I'm standing by them because fire. They basically sent me three. Take care of your body. It's the only place you have to live. Also sent me some citrus and herbal musk. Oh my God. Okay, when you think of deodorant, like the basic ass like deodorant smell, that's what this is, but like with a hint of like dreams. Deodorant isn't no like just go to the drugstore and get like a $5 deodorant. This is good, girl. This one is coconut and vanilla. We're gonna slide some of that on right now. It brings tips for your pits. Ooh, who was in the conference room and came up with that? Cause I know there was a group of like 10 people and Deborah stood up and they're like, what if we do a section and call it tips for, pretend I have glasses on, okay? Tits for your pits. Give her a raise because that's really good. That's really good. I like it. But so as for the deodorants, for this pack of three, it's normally $36. But if you click my link in the description and use the code MUNDA, you'll get a 33% off, which is $24. And that's good. Trust me, oh, they're worth the price. The one I recommend, personally, is the Citrus and Herbal Musk. It smells real good. Yeah, I'm gonna wash this off now because... Look how dirty this mirror is. Okay, let's not talk about it, okay? Ew, look how it's like dripping down. It's disgusting. Yo, all right, we're done here. I'm not gonna lie, I did not sign up for this heat. Hey, I just like wanted to get into painting. It's, it's like very, mm, you know, very relaxing, very. You know what I mean? Okay, okay. you know what isn't relaxing? It's the sun, Jesus. This is my canvas. This is where I'm going to be painting my masterpiece because I'm a master, but I'm gonna be painting. So here's the thing. I took a picture butt ass naked. The picture is right here. I have a picture in my hands. I printed it out and damn, this is it fire, no okay. cap. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna try painting myself my natural body with all the bumps and curves that I have. I genuinely, I'm not very comfortable yet in like my body, in my naked body, like. I don't, it sounds dumb, but it makes sense to me. Like, I can't just walk around naked confidently, but I want to, I want to do that. Okay, I'm going to start painting. Shut up. Yeah, I have my naked body here. Cool, stay there. This is so satisfying. Yeah, I'm definitely very confident right now. There's obviously still some things that I'm like, Ugh, about, you know? And one of those things is 
walking around butt ass naked. I can't do it. I just can't do it. Okay, I can't do it. I feel like painting my body and like putting some cool colors in it might make I don't know. I think it'll be a fun little like mental exercise. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Give it so much. I want the canvas to be real pretty. I'm gonna do like a cute little background, a cute little like transitioning background. You can even stop. That's not funny. This is a fun thing. This isn't nothing to like take serious. So what am I doing? Give me a second, okay? I'm not like a professional or nothing. Ew. Oh my god, I got pain in my hair. My hair's not even real. These birds need to like relax, dude. Oh god, they need to chill. Shut up! I don't know if it makes any sense what I'm doing. It's gonna go from like light colors to like dark colors because that's kind of how I feel about my body. I'm learning to like love it every day. It's a learning mechanism though. Damn, I just realized that I'm gonna have to let the canvas dry after this. It's okay, I guess. Hi. Thank you. <laughs> okay, don't knock anything over. You're getting dirt on my thingy. I'm gonna take a picture. Why? Okay, now I have to let it dry before I go in with my body. I think I fucked it up. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I messed up, but it's okay. Get off my thingy. I think I'm gonna draw my body in like white ink. Your body is a temple. I actually don't know what that means. I'm a little bad bitch, period. I do think that I can be like a bit more confident when it comes to my body. Cause my body's really not perfect. It may look like it is on social media because I know my angles. Uh, genuinely, like, it's not perfect. I don't think anybody's body is perfect. There is obviously times where I'll see a girl's body and I'm like, if my body lived like that, I wouldn't know how to act. And that's true, but that doesn't mean I like my body any less. You know what I mean? I don't know if I'm being dramatic too. Cause that could just be my view of myself. Other people might look at me and be like, chubby girl, where? These are my curves, what's up? It's obviously not gonna look perfect because I'm not an artist, I'm not a painter. This is my titty and it's my good titty. These are my arms, by the way. <laughs> My titties are pretty uneven. Okay, I promise I'm not that like unproportionate. <laughs> These are my thighs. And then that's where my cootie cat starts. I have like a little thing of fat like on here. I'm trying to make my titties more even because I promise you they're not that uneven. They're uneven, but like they're not, they're not hella. Then we have my belly button. My belly button's kind of weird. It's like kind of long. Yes, sir. I'm trying to fix my titties so much, but I can't. Okay, I feel like the hardest part is gonna be drawing my nipples. Yo, are these birds out here like reproducing or something? What is going on? This is my body. As you can see, it's really, it's genuinely not perfect. It's not even close to perfect. It's me though. But yeah, that's my body. Looking at it here, like looking at it in this painting, it's not a great painting. <laughs> I'm not like, I'm not out here being Picasso. She's cute. What I wanted to happen, happened. I actually like like the little stomach. My thighs are really nice. I got some big thick thighs. I used to hate my belly button. My belly button's actually pretty cute. Uh, I need to destroy this. This is the picture of my naked body. I actually really like painting. I feel like quarantine is really like bringing out a side of me that I kind of like suppressed. This is the painting that I was going off of. Do you want this? You want to buy this? Just kidding, it's my body. I'm not gonna sell it to you, weirdo. Do you wanna buy this one? Do you wanna buy this one? I hope you enjoyed my body. My body enjoys you. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next part of this video. Hey, so I'm gonna be following the self-care menu that I found on, on Pinterest. <clears throat> Number one, take a deep breath. <sighs> Good, I already feel more relaxed. <laughs> Number two, stretch your body. Hey, don't look at my toes. This is actually very, very nice. This is very relaxing. I like this. Number three, listen to your favorite song. That's my favorite song right now. Meditate on your purpose. What's my purpose? Scream. Did you just hear a little girl scream? Uh -huh. Okay, why? Ain't no little girls right here. Read a chapter of a book. What I'm gonna do instead of do that, I'm gonna take a sip out of this Capri Sun that I found in the fridge. I don't know whose it was. I took it out. Do you have a book that I can pretend to read? Yes. Never mind, I'm not going to waste my time. Journal out your thoughts. I'm journaling. Take a walk outside. I'm on a walk to the mailbox. Get crafty. This is my titty and it's my good titty. I was painting all day. Crafts. Cook a new recipe, no. Hey, welcome back. You're right on time, I'm almost done eating. How'd you like the video? Did you like it? Did you enjoy it? That's good. Hopefully you learned something from it. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in everybody, see you. And love you. Bye.
Oh my god. Um, to the people that saw the video before this one. <laughs> Wow, I can't believe I let him catch me like this. That's embarrassing. Oh well. But yeah, I'm reposting this video. I'm really sorry. I hate reposting videos. Then people get excited that there's a new video and it's like the same one they already watched. And then it's like, is this a Mandela effect? It's not a Mandela effect. I really, I reposted the video. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know if you guys have noticed. I haven't really been posting that much, but I'm recently getting into it again. I have a bunch of ideas written down. And I think you guys are going to like the videos that are coming. Bye, I love you. <laughs> I love you a lot. Also, Black Lives Matter, don't forget it, period.